Yo, dude, I will keep it a bug. They did my baby Lucille wrong. They did it wrong because this new armor, it takes its, its drop rate in Lucille. It's not really that great, but I tell you where it is great. Urgent quests. You know what about urgent quests that you can also kind of get around with? Triggers. So if you have triggers to do DFI rank four, or you have triggers to do Halfia Lake rank for whatever the newest rank is, rank four or whatever, rank three or whatever. The most recent ones, they have the, the urgent quest versions of them. Pretty much they're 100%. I literally, I went in there, I did some triggers, you know, and every single run I got in Ectasis armor. Every single one of DFI. I was doing DFI rank four. We're doing duos. And I got in Ectasis every single run. So I think they're literally 100%. Every time I seem to get one in the, in the urgent quest. So it seems like they're 100%. But in Lucille... Ran it uh, a, a lot of times, a good amount of times. Maybe I guess it maybe like 15 or something like that during our session. And uh, I'm not sure if I saw one. Not sure if I saw one. So, like I said, they did my baby Lucille dirty because that's my baby. That is my baby. And they did it dirty by making it like a hundred percent in the urgent quest, and then like whatever percentage it is in Lucille. Not good. Not good percentage, that's for sure. And then to boot, you know, it drops pretty much everything Lucille drops. You know, it drops growth mint. It drops Mars updaters. Drops add preset skill level once. So I mean, bro, they just, you know, they did Lucille dirty. And in the good group, you can clear it much quicker than Lucille. Bro, they did it dirty, man. But that being said, it also requires triggers. So, you know, naturally, you know, you may not have triggers sitting around or, you know, you, you don't want to buy triggers and stuff like that. So, uh, and there will be more ways to get these units moving forward. So, but either way, either way, man, it's just like, yo, why they do, why they do my baby Lucille like that, bro? Like, come on, man. Come on, man. Come on. A few things Lucille does have going forth, though, is of course, like still, I mean, still, Lucille's great, but of course, you know, still got some camos too, bro. Them camos, and you know, the camos are money too. So it was like, that's that's still great incentive also to be running with Sil. But you know, the Sil still always has its perks and it's, it's pros and stuff like that. And there's, you know, going to be some boosts on the Sil later on in the month. You know, some RGR boosts and stuff like that. So, but man, did it dirty. So, um, I mean, maybe on, maybe on paper, they were thinking about it like, oh yeah, put 100% in the urgent quest. That makes sense. But like they kind of over, they did an oversight on people who could just run triggers of that quest, and then it just makes this really accessible, you know. But anyways, that's why the price is tanked, by the way, because people were running, you know, the, this it's pretty it's easy, it's easily accessible. Let's be honest. So that being said, uh, I just wanted to say that we're right after jump. But should you be using the ectasis, the ectasis, however you want to pronounce it, the ectasis ice? Ice the X S the Enlupa. That's definitely not what the name of it is. But anyways, should you be using it? Uh, pretty much it boils down to this. So we know that these units will be enhanceable in the future with the new item lap feature that we have coming up in a couple months. So we know this, and this is they've implemented this way, and I imagine they're implementing it in this way for us to ex get them accessibly, you know, because the way that they're doing this direction, you know, is going to, you're going to need materials to add stuff to it. So of course, you know, they have no HP, no PP on this. I mentioned that in the most recent video, but you know, we're going to be able to add things like that to the units with the new item lab future. So pretty much how I would look at it and how I'm kind of approaching it. You know, of course I already have, you know, orgies five, uh, I need I've had those for, better half of half a year. I think Ines came out in February. So, I mean, I've had those from April, May, something like that. The regular ones, you know, I farm for everything. So, uh, you know, I've had those and, you know, I have top logs on, on everything. So basically how I'm kind of doing it is, uh, I'm just going, I'm still going to keep grinding for these new units, but pretty much I'm going to just kind of, you know, grind for them and, and build up Gamba. I'm just going to Gamba them and try to get my fixes high. 
so I tonight I was able to take a you know a one from nothing to an Orsis three. So I mean, so there's no reason for me to hastily move over. I will be using some of my transfer passes for my units because it makes more sense instead of using it for my weapons. But for me personally, but um, that's what I will be doing. But I'm not in any rush to do so, especially when my current units are fixed to five or it's just and it's just a 0.5 difference or well, 1.5 with all three together, which is it's significant, but it's not worth, you know, trading off the level five, you know, unless they're all three, you know, level five, of course. So that's kind of how I'm going about it. So that would be my recommendation to you if you're in the same position that I am in where you have already like top augments and you have a fix of five or or whatever fix of five i need if you're already in that position then then i would say yeah you know just build build them up so that way when it does come you're ready to make that move over otherwise you know there's no reason to be hasty about it be patient patience is a virtue y'all patience is a virtue and i might come and work you have you farm some orchards for me so we can be strong too and we can do a uh, frugal menudo tastes good with a spoon though yo ho 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 but it's not christmas bro oh no where is he going? Anyways, so that would be my recommendation. Be sure to like, subscribe. I will see you on the next one. Let me know if you have any questions down in the comments below. We'd love to answer them. Much love, holla. Spike Zoo content.